بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Good afternoon my dear brothers and sisters My name is Khalid Mansour Al-Awar and I have always wanted to win the Oscars Unlike all the speakers that you will see today I have not accomplished anything Most of you probably don't even know who I am but what I have achieved and accomplished I did on a personal level Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Holy Quran, لا يغير الله ما بقوم حتى يغيروا ما بأنفسهم In order for you to make a change around you, the change must first start from within. A change in your attitude, a change in strengthening your faith and belief, and pushing forward towards your ultimate goal. My own life, it has always been like a jigsaw puzzle. I had all the pieces right there in front of me, scattered around. I didn't know how the pieces would look like once they have all connected, or how the final outcome would be. In 2006, I had a set goal and a set dream for what I wanted to do and what I wanted to become. I went to Canada to get my degree. I wanted to graduate and start my career, become a film producer, go to Hollywood, and win the Oscars. Day after day, my vision got distracted. Setback after setback after setback, my dreams slowly started to fade, and my passion started to die, and failure was just one step away. Three years later, I had to come back with nothing to show off for. I held my head in shame. Shame that I have failed. Shame that I am the one that couldn't make it. I sat there thinking to myself, the whole world has turned its back on me. All the doors being shut in my face. And seeing all the people around me pursuing their goals and moving forward while my own life stood still and moved in reverse. I realized that I had to be patient because great things come after a long series of bad events. Patience is truly a virtue. Patience to have faith that your creator have set a path for you that is best for you. Patience to believe and know that one day you will see and you will find the light at the end of the dark, narrow tunnel. If I was ever given the chance to go back in time and change something from my past, it would be none. Because all the rough times, the unknown fate, the constant worry, and all the failures made everything worth it in the end. It has shaped me and nurtured me to become the person standing right here in front of you today and it will always push me to pursue my goals and carry me when I am down. وَعَسَىٰ أَن تَكْرَهُ شَيْئًا وَهُوَ خَيْرٌ لَكُمْ وَعَسَىٰ أَن تُحِبُّ شَيْئًا وَهُوَ شَرٌ لَكُمْ وَاللَّهُ يَعْلَمُ وَأَنْتُمْ لَا تَعْلَمُونَ Sometimes the path that life drags you towards might not seem very pleasing and satisfying for you. You want something else. Like sometimes you want something so badly and you, you do whatever you do, you can't get it. Well, sometimes you are in a situation where you don't want to be in and you try so hard to get out of that situation, but you can't. You have to know and you have to believe that you are where you are because it is written for you. Because in order for you to reach your objectives and the goals that you have set for yourselves, you must overcome these obstacles and you must face those fears and failures. Because other people, they will know you from your successes. But you, you will know yourselves from your failures. I wasn't very happy with the path that my life was taking. It wasn't satisfying for me, like going to Zayed University. That was not my dream, that was not what I aspired for. 
but I had to have a sense of comfort and peace. So I went to Zayed University. I failed to look at the bright side of life, at how it was all scripted for me that in order for me to succeed and continue my journey, I had to fail and I had to fall and I had to pick myself up. As now, because I went to Zayed University, I'm continuing my journey towards my goal. And I'm re-establishing myself. I'm almost there towards getting my degree. I became the president of the first student council. I found a good job. And in Zayed University, I met my beautiful wife. So with my family's support and my willingness to go that extra mile, pieces of my puzzle started coming back together again. And I saw the light at the end of the dark, narrow tunnel. And now, after everything, I am in the light again. My name is Khalid Mansour Al-Awar, and one day, inshallah, I will win the Oscars. Thank you.